Okay. I was going to ask you about uh, uh, AJ Green, obviously outstanding player. What is it that makes him so special? Well, obviously, um, how long he is. You know, he's very long and athletic. Uh, he runs well, probably the best receiver I saw in quite a while. Um, obviously, has great ball skills, but I mean, just uh, uh, three and a half quarters he played against Colorado uh, separates him from all those guys in America. Well, what can you tell a 5 10 quarter cornerback trying to cover a guy like him? Well, we're going to put our, try to put ourselves in good position to compete. Um, obviously, genetics has a lot to do with uh, you know with a guy that big, but um, we got some things in our scheme that we got to account for him, and uh, hopefully, we can get a few guys around him, put some pressure on the quarterback, and uh, force it to be a tight throw. Does it help to stuff him at the line? Is that help at all? Uh, well, it depends. You know, you don't want to try to stuff him at the line and lose him at the line. You know, we want to give ourselves a chance to win late in the down, so uh, we're going to mix up some things that we're going to do. You got a bigger corner in art. Would that be a better match, or does it, you even worry about matchups? No, because the way they move them around, I mean, you can't really plan for them to be in one spot. So even if we did try to match a certain person on them, they can motion and shift them to different spots and really get us in an uh, un uncomfortable matchup somewhere else. So uh, we're going to play our plan, and uh, wherever he lands, or we'll play him wherever he goes. Do you think guys like that kind of bring the best out of some of your guys in you know, competition? -wise? Yeah, I mean, we've had a great week uh, of practice, and obviously going against a guy like this is a challenge, and I think he has a chip on his shoulder because of what happened to him early in the season and uh, obviously we got uh, some improvement that we can do too so it'll be a good battle we're excited does he open up stuff for other receivers too is that something you guys got to keep it keep in mind yeah i mean receivers? at the end of the day um you know if, if you put too much attention on them some other guys can get loose and as a group they're a talented group of receivers and uh, they use their fullback and tailback in the screen game and they got some tight ends who can really stretch the field vertically so we have to count for all of them Jansen probably had one of the best games of his career. How do you get that to carry over from his home state? But, yeah, I mean, obviously Jansen played well last week. Uh, we knew going into Baton Rouge it was going to be a special occasion for him uh, with the entire recruiting process and all. He played well. Hopefully we can continue to build on it. And, uh, you know, as a group, I thought we fought, and uh, we just got to continue to try to win when we get in some one-on-one -on -one situations. How did you feel like your